name is Jason Mark. I'm with SAC Incorporated. Uh, we are a utility construction company. Um, along with our sister company, Legacy Site Work, we specialize in residential construction, starting from the ground up and providing turnkey lots for developers. We are a fourth generation company. My great grandfather started it back in the 50s and it's gone down through the times to where me and my brother are now at the charge of it. The Dominion, uh, that is one where we're taking a project that's got a, quite a bit of topography to it, a lot of hills, uh, not your typical standard type of project and be nice finished lots after it. Challenges on a project like that are obviously the terrain, a lot of the side slopes when you're cutting into the streets, but you know, we took that one, we had 25,000 yards to mill, um, took a couple of our 1055s with the terrain levelers on it, that real good mobile machines that handle that rock pretty well and turned them loose on the milling, got the, got the streets ready to turn over to one of our 1255s and then an 1155 to uh, start trenching for the utilities. That one had 15,000 total feet of, of trench. Uh, that one, for the sewer, I think we got down to about 16 foot of cuts. That's about two and a half foot wide with those machines. The drains got down to around 18 foot on the cuts. And um, that one, the biggest, the widest we had to go was to accommodate a five foot concrete box, five foot wide box, ended up being on that one about eight and a half foot wide the trench total so multiple cuts having to ribbon cut through there um, the water is just your standard you know five foot of cover for the 12 inch line that went through there so six to six and a half foot of of cut going through that one the biggest challenge was definitely the the topography getting started getting where we had got, could get the streets level to bring the saws in and and just getting it to where the the milling machines could have good level runs and we could keep them without having any obstructions, let them go. Time they start up in the morning to where they're you know, shutting down in the evening. Once we're able to get a good game plan together, having, the, having those machines that we have, you know, they are able to handle the rock out there, able to, to make real good production and just continue on with that. And with the people that we have, just through all the coordination, you know, everything went in in a timely fashion.